this. And to the families out there, to just God bless you and just be strong. And I'm really sorry for everything, for everyone out there. God bless you too, Christopher. Thank you for sharing that story. We hope you get some help. So, I'm sorry. I I definitely had to show me in a state where that this I was crying like this. This is serious, um, and I really don't take it lightly at all. Um, just I say, man. I mean, just hearing that man just talk, um, just talk about it. He started off all cool and just hyped about, you know, just talking about the situation at hand. And he broke down after talking about it. And he said some people don't see it. I mean, they see it, but they don't feel it. And I feel this, like, as political, as as pro-black as you might think I am, I'm... I'm Pro love, and that's the only thing I stand for. That's so. Don't even think that I'm pro black. And even though I might touch on topics of race, I mean, we have to understand that that race is around us all the time. If if I have to fill out an application and put my race on the application, then that's a problem. Like, why do we have to put categories on things in the first place? That's that's the reason why I'm in and the problem that I'm in right now is because of a category. And what I'm trying to say is that maybe race needs to be put down. Maybe like we just need to be American. Matter of fact, maybe we just need to be humans of the human race, if anything. So I'm going to continue to talk about race as long as it's prevalent in our community, as long as it's prevalent in this world. That's what I'm going to continue to talk about. There, there was, you know, a little backlash about me saying that, you know, if this was a black person, um, that it it it'll be all he would either be killed or he, his his image would be posted everywhere on the news, but it wasn't. Somebody made a comment, um, Miss Love made a comment about, like, why is this not called a terrorist attack? Because that's what it is. Why is this not called, you know, why is he not called a, a terrorist? Like, and why wasn't he killed right on spot? Why did they wait for him? I mean, like, I understand that they say that, you know, it could have been a bomb in his house. And maybe they, oh, wait a minute. If he's not killed on the spot, I had it. Wait, why not kill him now? Huh? Kill him. Y'all kill us? Constantly. This right here, this don't need a Troy Davis. He he is admitted to it. You know who it is? Kill him. But killing them won't solve anything. It won't. It will not. Because he's gonna he's gonna get his justice, but at the same time, we have to look at the fact that four guns, six thousand rounds of ammunition, all in sixty days. He was able to get all of this, all of it, in sixty days. But you continue to police our communities, continue to put us in jail for drug charges. Continue to put us in jail because of, um, let's say, um, my man, um, what's his name, um, a, a political fighter, um, what's his name, who killed the officer, um, my man from Atlanta, um, somebody help me out if I, I can't think of it now, but dude is from Atlanta, they have him in um, California, um, in, in jail now, um, once I get his name, I'll post it, but he's in jail for killing a cop and this man killed 14 no 15 people what's up so this one right here is a little bit longer post but something tell me maybe i might i 
might y'all might not see me <laughs> y'all might not this might be my last posting but something tell me the government has something to do with this so pray for me because why would you allow someone to get four guns 60, no, my, my, I'm sorry, 6,000 rounds of ammunition in 60 days. It's sad. So parents, what I am saying, because of any time I am going to lead this, protect your children. Don't just give them the name brand clothes. Don't buy them every toy. Buy them every book. Give them the knowledge to understand the things that is happening around them constantly. Allow them to know the hidden things that are right before us. Open your eyes, parents. Protect your children. I love you. And I hope this gets to all of you. Thank you.